Yo, what up? This is Rick Thorne, Biker in Black here in Las Vegas at Magic 2015 for Sold and Clothing. We're hanging out at the booth right now. We got Daniel Rocha, James Strickland, they're tattooing, as well as all the new gear. We're going to be hanging out at Magic because is it true that what happens in Vegas should stay in Vegas? I don't know. Daniel Rocha, like Zach De La Rocha. Uh, How you doing, buddy? Good, man. I'm doing real good. How's it down here at the uh, trade show so far? Good, man. It's, it's a little different than a tattoo convention, and uh, kind of enjoy it a little bit more. It's a little bit more quiet. It is low-key, right? Yeah, yeah, a lot more low-key. I'm going to ask you, what would you tell any kid out there that wants to start tattooing? Or not kid, but anybody, any, anybody in the world. What would be your first saying? Yo, someone says, I'm going to start tattooing. What would you say to them? Just never stop learning you know that's the main thing I can tell someone that's just starting off you know or if they're uh, they're trying to get into it just do it the right way you know get yeah. an apprenticeship you know um, learn the right way don't don't fucking don't don't have too many skeletons in the closet basically so we're stoked to have you on solo dude you rock bro yeah, hell yeah thank you yeah thank stoked you. to have you here and you got a cool ass last name right <laughs> yeah. yo Daniel Rocha uh. James, how you doing, buddy? Doing good. How about yourself? So what are you out here doing? Uh, tattooing this girl's arm over here. Rad. Yeah. It's yeah. pretty cool. Have you ever tattooed at a trade show before? No, I, know, I didn't even know what the fuck a trade show was until I got here. So. That's where they trade stuff. Yeah, I just figured that out. It's pretty cool, man. Yeah, I just <laughs> traded in my Pokemon cards. Oh, yeah, for some He-Mans, you know. Like, little... a, like a Charizard one or something like yeah, that? Yeah, we trade. You know, you can hear you trade. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so what's new, dude? How you been? Been good, man. Just fucking... Got back from Hawaii, that was pretty cool. And just working, doing the same shit different places though, you know? Yeah, uh, no, I hear you. Yeah. Well, you're an amazing artist. We're stoked you're here. Thank you, thank you, I appreciate it. So I've been asking everybody, do you think it's true what happens in Vegas should stay in Vegas? Definitely. Like what kind of stuff? Anything you do should be <laughs> Anything. Anything you do. Even if you breathe. Even if you breathe. Definitely partying stays in Vegas. Whoever you meet sometimes stays in Vegas. Unless you're bit, you live Unless in LA? Business. You in LA? I live in LA. Or so, up. Yeah, what so up? we're here for business. So, you know, you have to mingle a little bit, you know. So but. I might see you again in LA? Definitely. See, so that might not stay in Vegas. Correct. What's one of the craziest things you've seen happen in Vegas? Craziest. Not like this not typical crazy, but what's the craziest thing you've ever seen? A guy running around naked down the street. <laughs> it's normal in my hood. Everything should stay in Vegas. Good and bad? Good and bad. Like what kind of stuff? Streaking on the uh, on the boulevard. Streaking on the boulevard should yeah. stay in Vegas. Drinking might... too much, okay. getting sick. Yeah. What about gambling? Uh, no good. Yeah. Yeah, no good. Yeah. You waste the money, you spend it on chicks better. Right. Yeah. You know, you know the, uh, the whole thing about the Fight Club is that we don't talk about the Fight Club. Who's the Fight Club? Exactly. Hey, do you think what happens in Vegas should stay in Vegas? Yes. What about you? Yeah. Like what kind of stuff? All kinds of stuff. Like if you're gluten free and you break your gluten diet here, that kind of thing? Yes. Oh, for sure. Oh, yeah. You don't yeah, want to yeah. go home and have people know about that. You don't want anybody to know that you broke your diet? Yeah. <laughs> Indulge. Or like, or like picking your nose and eating your burgers kind of thing. Oh, word. If that followed you back home, you'd be ruined. Yeah, it stays in Vegas, dude. You got you got a little, yeah. <laughs> Yo, Mo, what up, dude? What up, Rick Thorne? Yeah, how, are you? how you doing? Good, good, good. 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 Nice glasses. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Where's your stolen cold app? Bam. Do you think everything that happens in Vegas should stay in Vegas? Yes, I do. Is that meaning, like, always, you always think bad right away? Well, you think good stuff should stay only, in Vegas? Only if you have, like, a girlfriend or a wife or someone that could, you could get in trouble with. Otherwise, I'd say bring it home. Night and day, in and out, clubs and bars. And yeah, plus two, I mean, like you could be like, hey, I'm itching a lot, and you gotta explain to your friends why.
Hey, do you think what happens in Vegas should stay in Vegas? Fuck yeah. Good and bad? Like, I married a midget stripper a while ago. I don't want my wife knowing about that now, you know? So, right. yeah, you got to keep some shit secret, you know? <laughs> You married a midget too? Yeah, man. So did I. Yeah, it's cool. I mean, yeah, you yeah. say that because you're tall. You're trying to say I'm a midget. I'm not marrying you, bro. I'm out. Yo, thanks a lot for watching. I'm Rick Thorne. This is Solon TV. Until next time, stay rad. Hey, ready? Good smile. Ready? One, two, three. <laughs> Don't ruin our shot. Oh, this is just... Yo! Yo! Yo, what up? This is Rick Thorne, the biker in black here for Soul and Clothing at Magic 2015. We're here. So what happens in Vegas should stay in Vegas. Definitely. Even this interview. Yes. Okay. Horrible. Okay, delete. <laughs> delete. <laughs>